everyone. Before we get started, please hit that subscribe button down below and let's get cooking. Today we are making a buttery garlic herb chicken with asparagus. As you see here, I've got about a pound of asparagus and what I've done is trimmed it about an inch from the bottom. We're going to wash it, set it aside before we start handling our chicken. You'll need three to six chicken thighs with bone in and skin on. I'm using four here and I'm patting it dry on both sides, even the cutting board all around. All of this is supposed to help with the crispiness of the skin when we start frying it. Grab your large skillet and put it on medium heat. We're gonna add our butter, our garlic, rosemary, oregano, and thyme into our skillet to make it fragrant and this is getting our sauce going. And you're going to notice in here that I probably didn't add that much time because I'm not a huge fan of it. So maybe I added about a quarter teaspoon, if that. <laughs> also, another thing to add is that the recipe that I found this on says to use fresh oregano, thyme, and rosemary. I just used the dry seasoning of it and it worked out pretty well for me. Now you're going to throw in your chicken skin side down, but you'll notice here that I'm seasoning it with salt, pepper, and paprika. You're supposed to do this to taste in about a half a teaspoon of paprika. I forgot to do that beforehand, and so I'm doing it right inside the pan. Make sure you do it on both sides. Once you flip your chicken, make sure you cook it until it reads about 165 degrees on your thermometer, approximately 5 to 7 minutes-ish. And if you notice your chicken is browning too fast, just lower your heat. Once your chicken is done cooking, we're going to set it aside on a clean plate. And then we're going to add another tablespoon of butter and we're going to let that melt and get all nice and bubbly and yummy in there. And then we're going to add our asparagus. We're going to let that cook for about four minutes, four to six minutes, but I did mine for about four minutes. You want to do this until it gets tender. Now we're going to deglaze our pan. So I used a quarter cup of chicken broth. Use water if you don't have chicken broth readily available. And we're going to coat our asparagus and then we're going to let it reduce in the pan for about a minute. As you can see here, dinner is pretty much done at this point. Your sauce has been reduced, so go ahead and throw your chicken back in there. We're going to let that cook for a few more minutes. And once that's done, you can garnish it with some parsley and some lemon. You can serve it as is. If you'd like, you can also eat it with some rice and pasta or some bread on the side. But less than 30 minutes. This is all it took. Here's our food nicely plated. This is the buttery garlic herb chicken with asparagus. I will go ahead and link you guys the recipe link in the description box below. And as always, thank you for watching. Make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button. And until the next meal, I'll see you again. Thanks. Bye.